Because we experience it all throughout the year. Mm -hmm. The drive all it's the way hotel. around. So that's the hotel? That's one of the hotels. Oh, that's the AC. Okay, mm -hmm. there's an AC in Kingston too. So this that's is a pretty, mall. Pretty um, new. That one? Yeah. It's pretty new. Wow. So this is a mall. This is a Tory Birch. And then Mark Jacobs, Marcy, Rebecca it, Taylor, Elf Murray. Wow, Saint Laurent. Okay. Wow. <laughs> That's wow. the different level of bougie right there. Yeah. That's actually smart. It's money making scheme. Because mm -hmm. when once you be in the hotel, I mean, what do you do? You go downstairs and you go shopping. Right. I guess that's one of the hotels. Yeah. The other one. Yeah, I think that's a. Uh, is that in it? It's still constructed. Oh, it looks yeah, nice though. I can't all imagine how expensive I can't apartments are. Right there, so pass like over here so every day. <laughs> <laughs> you won't be saving. <laughs> every single day. It half of the nice. uh, half of over here would be over there in my apartment. <laughs> it looks bougie, but nice. Wow, this is huge. They have cinemas. Guys, people here are shopping with suitcases, meaning they come and they pack their suitcase up with clothes that they bought. The mall is that big, and look at the line <laughs> to go into Nike. Oh, Mike. And then the line at the cashier too. That's wild. <laughs> huge. Very huge. Wow. Another suitcase over there. We're at the outside part. Right. Oh, they got Shake Shack in here too. Wow. It's the mommy favorite store to get talking about. Look at nice little workouts. Uh -huh. You'll be overwhelmed. Yeah. Sometimes you're here, you grab what you want and what you need. The other store is on the square other side. Uh -huh. So it makes more sense for you to get in the car, drive around, and go to that store. There are. Because if you try to walk it, plus. Wow. Yeah, Capitalism. The bridal right. store. Wow. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna make our own cookie sandwich. We're gonna make our own cookie sandwich. So, we have steps. Step one, two, three, four. And the first step is picking your own cookie, top and bottom, or you can pick a brownie. I think I wanna, I'll start off. I'm gonna do a brownie bottom. I'm gonna do a brownie bottom. And then, uh, what's the difference between the cookie of the month and the chocolate chip cookie? What's the difference between the chocolate chip cookie and the cookie of the month? Stop, I want to try the one. <laughs> wow. So she's gonna warm it up and it's gonna stay cold on the inside, but warm on the outside, so let's see how that's done. She's gonna put the mini 
chocolate chip on mine and uh, yeah You know what this place reminds me of? It just reminds me of a Soho or like when you go to New York City and you go into all the different Yeah. That's what it's giving me. This is cool. Which one? One is nice. Hmm. Oh. And like, those are real fishes? And wow! The women collect nuts, roots, and wild mushrooms. Huh. <laughs> Come with a list. Can you go wild? I can't imagine working in the in this mall. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. I did say I was gonna get some crocs in a two for 39. Oh no, those slippers ones. Oh, the crocs? Uh-huh. And they have lime green. Wait, no. One of the many food courts that we're looking at now. Woo. Now we're trying to figure out where we are and where we're gonna go. You wanna click the, t wanna click the tea? Yeah. And TJ Max. Yeah, I was looking for a red name. Oh, oh. see how far we are. <laughs> far. I wish you would tell us how. What's the mileage? What's the um, steps? Steps. Yeah. And it does tell you turn left, turn right. Veer left. What's the difference between veer left and turn left? Turn is that. Veer is that. <laughs> Guys, we're on our way into the Primark. There's a whole entire Primark, and I only thought it was in the UK, but we are in Florida. Um, I hope I find some little bargains. It's, it's definitely like a bargain store. Auntie Camille said she came in here before, and she wasn't impressed. <laughs> Guys, I'm in Price, in the Primark right now, and I must say they have some cute little stuff like. They're, they're cute. Oh, they're cute. I don't know where Auntie Camille is, but some are kind of gone. It's not too bad. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna show you a quick little show and tell of what I got. So, I bought some mascara. I'm gonna get some from the beauty supply store as well, but this was, I think, $3. So, I picked it up just to see what it was like um a little makeup brush two dollars some oopsies some uh, beauty blender sponges i just needed new ones so this was 180 a passport book i just got my passport in it i already put my passport in it i got some little house slippers which i'm gonna buy at least two more um when I get back to Buffalo to send down to Jamaica, this was five dollars. So it was it was so comfy and definitely worth it. They're looking like this, so I can't wait to test them out. It's nothing, nothing airing. So when I go out, at least I can dress up myself. Melt and a beef supreme beef supreme burrito beef burrito burrito. A beef um, burrito supreme, which was $3.99, and I got two chicken chipotle melt. There we go. This is what the burrito is. Inside of this is looking like. 
Wow. Ben, peace out. Hey guys, so I know it's really late and I know I basically didn't do anything in Florida, but I promise you New York City will be different. Um, the live that you just saw, make sure you follow everybody. They all have YouTube, they all have Instagram, and they all have amazing content, especially when it comes to lifestyle and travel in Jamaica and real estate. So definitely go down into the um, description box and check out their channels. It would mean a lot to me, and I'm pretty sure you'll find your favorite YouTuber from one of us or, you know, add us to a group of your favorite Jamaican content creators. <laughs> Guys, good morning. I'm on my way to the airport. Malik doesn't want to be vlogged. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys on the other side in New York City. Enjoy the B-roll. On this plane, eight doors, four on each side. Four doors have detachable slides that can be used as rafts. An additional raft. I just landed in New York City and right behind me I'm already seeing the famous yellow cabs that New York City is popular for. I'm still in the airport because my sister is on her way to come and pick me up so I'm looking forward to that. It's like a role reversal. Um, I'll put the video up of when. Is it on this side? I'll put the video up here of when um, I came, I picked her up from the airport, so full circle. Um, my sister is an active person, she actually she likes to do things, so I know for a fact that I'll have content and things for you to do in New York City. Not that my family members in Florida didn't have things to do or didn't like to do things, it was just short minute or last minute. I'm getting tongue tied, it was last minute with my um, Florida family. so. I'm um, excited to see what my New York City family has planned. Peace out. And I'll see you in the New York vlog. Bye guys. Guys, we're at Hi Hop. I haven't been to I Hop in like 12 years. Probably 12, okay. Probably like 10 years I haven't been to I Hop. But me and my sister are here and she was parking the car. So she'll be right back. But this is what the menu is looking like. And I don't know what to get. I think I'm gonna get an omelet. Cause I like to get omelet. And I think I'm gonna get um, pancake because you have to get pancakes when you go to IHOP, right? Um, but I don't know. I don't know. Oh, guys, I complete mid bite. Then I remembered. I'm so sorry. But the food still looks really good. If you <laughs> at least I'm showing you something and not the empty plate. Um, I'm gonna enjoy. I'm enjoying myself right now, so that's why. But. This is what my sister is eating. Um, but anyways, and I also forgot to show you the hot chocolate. I'm so sorry, but we'll be back. <laughs> okay guys, so me and my sister, we're going into Whole Foods. She likes Whole Foods and Trader Joe's as well. So she's gonna get her flowers. And she likes to buy bouquet. Um, and then she's just gonna get some other small little household stuff. Like these. Do you mix them or do you just sometimes buy one? Sometimes I buy individuals and make my own. Oh. Uh, but I love Tigonia. I think those are pretty. I like the um the blue.
chocolate wax. And my eyes are tearing up. I don't know if you guys can tell a difference. I got chocolate wax on my face and my eyebrows. So that's kind of cool. Katie's putting me on. <laughs> She's pamper queen. No, I'm not. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> Have you guys ever had Shake Shack before? And champagne out of a spray. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, water out of a champagne glass. Right. Um. Let me move this one over. It's different. Yeah, that's true. It tastes more fancy. I know a lot of y'all had had Shake Shack before, but it's been a while. You got your chicken burger, right? Mm -hmm. oh, thank you. So let's lift it up and show you guys. I tried my best. Now me and my sister, we're gonna go enjoy our food and watch Golden Girls. <laughs> Peace out. Guys, so we're trying to go to a next spot. It is currently here. One o'clock. <laughs> Not too bad. I'm gonna put this down. Crazy time! Oh, Crystal's about to call the next spot and see if um we can get in. If not, then probably gonna head home. Tonight was fun. We outside. We outside. <laughs> For everybody watching in Jamaica, don't malice me. All right. <laughs> Jamaican ass, like, oh, the roads. I'm like, you kidding me? Like, you kidding me? No, Jamaican road is worse than. Way. Some parts. No, the majority. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we stopped at a gas station. I'm about to go get something inside. I would put my mask on, but, well, I don't have my mask on. Okay, I'm gonna just put my mask on. Um, before I enter, so hold on. All right, inside. Look at how much chocolate. Y'all know I love chocolate, but I'm not in the chocolate mood. Ooh, I feel for something sweet. I feel for something sweet. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. I've been getting wedges all this time. Sour patch. Why do I feel for sour patch? Is that weird? Like something sour, something sweet. Oh no. Mm. More juice. Oh look. Peace tea. Arizona. You know how much Arizona is in Jamaica? <laughs> Expensive 99. They also have nuts. Kideen. Katie gone off with tree water. So I guess she bought me a water. I don't know. This underwear. Sorry. <laughs> Give me a widget. Alright, guys, I'll be back. I'm just walking around at this point. <laughs> We're in Boston. Well, we're in Boston. <laughs> Can't talk for long, but this is what I'm looking at now. The camera isn't leaning, the road is just lopsided, which is funny. But I'll see you guys when I'm out of the car. 
all right guys so i just ate at a jamaican restaurant in boston and it was it was very rough to say the least so we're about to head to our hotel now let's try not saying about this good and all of we all of us we didn't finish the food so it's kind of sad but we move we're gonna um go to the hotel and then i'll get back to you these are prescriptions not shades so i i can't really take them off and not sit right so all right guys so we just checked in just went to our room um my sister is downstairs without any of the keys so i'm about to go let her in um this hotel though inside we have a suite it is really pretty and you need a key to get onto the elevator so we're gonna dip out so you have to do that didn't work that time let's see or you're just stuck in here but you saw the green and then it will go down to one and yeah i'm gonna help my sister get back upstairs and then show you guys what the room is looking like So we're in the park in Boston, in the city of Boston. Anybody who is from Boston, drop a comment down below and let me know. There's a bunch of people laying out, but they might be homeless or just taking a little nap. It's an interesting little park. It's called the Boston Commons. I'm gonna try to get some drone footage for you all, but it's cute. It's a cute little park this is my family um yeah so i'm gonna try my best to get some drone videos if i can i looked at the boston uva website um and it didn't really say anything about anything specific so i just have to make sure i can always see the drone um and i'm good I just you know can't fly in certain areas and that will come up on the fly app so yeah it's very calming As you guys can see, there is a tennis court. There's also a basketball court behind it. So you can come here and relax and just do whatever you want. You get hamburgers and ice cream over there and just chill out. It's a very calm and quiet location full of family and friends, as it appears to be family and friends. <laughs>
I'm back from downtown Boston. Since I'm at the hotel, I'm going to utilize the gym that they have. And as you've seen from the clips that, you know, I'm just gonna pop them up right now while I'm talking. So they have a pretty nice gym. They have some decent amount of weights. They have treadmills. They have um, elliptical. And one of my favorite machines is the, um, for some reason, I don't, the cable machine. They have the cable machine which is really amazing. I love gyms that have cable machine because it's my favorite thing to use when I work out. Um, right now, I'm actually going to just warm up. Um, I'm gonna warm up myself. I'm just gonna probably do a couple sit-ups, do some push-ups, stretch, and then I'm gonna go over on the treadmill behind me for about 15 to 20 minutes. I'm just gonna walk on probably an incline of four and a speed of let's say five um some speed walking uphill speed walking and then after that i'm going to um i'm gonna work on my lower body i'm gonna throw in like probably three upper body workouts that i really like but i'm gonna focus on lower body because when i start off working out i have worked out in months um, when I start off working out, I like to do something that I find fun because if I start off with something that I don't like, the chances of me coming back is incredibly lower. So we're going to do that. So let's jump right into it. Enough of the talking. Drop some comments down below. Let me know if you go to the gym. If you don't go to the gym, what type of workout activities do you do? Do you dance? Do you do yoga? Do you walk around the park? Zumba? Do you salsa? What do you do to stay fit? I find it very important for us to stay fit and eat healthy. Even though I have 25% loading in the staying fit part and about 50% in the healthy part, eating healthy part, um, we're working on it. We're human. So just drop a comment and let me know. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next clip. Good morning guys, so I'm all dressed, we're going to head to IHOP to get some breakfast because our experience with the Jamaican restaurant is <laughs> terrible, so we're going to stick to what we know. Um, my sister and my cousin, they're looking so cute, I really want to show you their outfits, but I'll ask them and when we get downstairs, I'll show you what they look like. So today we don't know what we're gonna do, but we're gonna. Oh no, we're we're guys. We're back. All right, so we just parked. Um, as you can see, it's still raining, but it's cute, you know. Oh, I'm gone left way. It's a cute little, it's a cute little area that we'll buck up on. How many of you have eaten at IHOP? Let me know what you normally get, pancake wise. Recently, I was put on to, um, what is it, the cheesecake pancake? Oh my goodness, I can't even imagine. It's so good, it's worth it. Normally I get chocolate chips or I just get regular, but the cheesecake is not my new favorite. <laughs> And I normally get an omelet, any kind of omelet, but I think today I'm gonna go light and just get regular egg sausage and um, hash browns with a side of the cheesecake omelet. But I'll hit you guys up when I'm out on the street. All right, so sampler scrambled with the shelled eggs. Just had our top, top yell breakfast, and now, and now we're gonna go find something to do. It's still raining. It paused for like a quick second, but I don't know. Boston, there's not really much to do in the sense of like touristy things. We can definitely go check out Harvard, um, but. And then we can also go check out, I think the first Starbucks is in Boston, but um, there's a lot of tours. Also the Boston Tea Party, we can check that out as well, but you know, we're gonna have to figure it out real soon because we don't wanna you know, continuously walk around and just rain. But anyways, 
I'm gonna head up to the car and I'll see you guys later. Peace. 30, 20. Mm -hmm. And that place is really busy. Okay. We're asking for attractions okay. and hey, things to do good. by a local here. Right. Good. Right. Okay. Okay, we'll, we'll check it out. So by the water, then. Okay. So we're by the Gillette Stadium at the little shopping center, but it's raining hard and it's cold. So we might just abandon this little trip that we had planned. But it's cute out here, I can't lie. It's just, it's right here is more for Florida weather. It's, it's a bit cold. restaurants cool it's indoor and outdoor I mean most restaurants are but it's literally like the glass right here opens right into inside and they have seating so that's cool probably on a on a day where it's warm <laughs> but I guess it's kind of empty here but it's still cute There's a movie theater somewhere, but I don't see it. I guess they have a bowling alley. Oh. Nice place. Ooh, CBD medic. That's marijuana, and I believe um, recreational marijuana is legal in Boston, so that's pretty cool. Guys, this was a proper fail. It's really cold and wet. Do what? Oh. How gone, sister? Oh, I think I need heat. Where are the next thing? Is it? One for the ages. So the place I knew. The sea cars. Yeah. Well, I don't know what their roads are made of. On a party on the low, they don't make sure they did it. Music vibe. Young Joe, DJ Avalanche, to be I. Ring it back the most of DC Rico. The stage starts playing that big bad soccer. Smoking the bar. back at the hotel and um we we're just driving around we got lost a couple times and you know we were just sightseeing the neighborhood but on our way back to the hotel we did see that there was a some sort of a plaza or shopping center right behind our hotel that had um tj maxx yeah. they had best buy um and another shopping center so it was very interesting Look how much it's raining. It's crazy, right? It's been raining all day, but we're about to head in. About to head into the cheesecake factory. So my cousin y'all come for me. Hey. <laughs> all right. <laughs> no sir. Wait. Oh, it's nice in here. I've been to Cheesecake Factory before, but this one is cute. Have a little vibes. I've always sat in the booth, though. I haven't sat in anything but the booth. 
what our food is looking like. I got the four cheese pasta with chicken. My cousin got the Cajun pasta. <laughs> and we both got this smoothie. So the camera's about to die and if it does shut off, hasta la vista, bye bye. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And Katie, Katie's ready to hit the road. Um, Yeah, so bye guys. Alright, good morning guys. So if you reached this far in the vlog and you haven't liked, comment, or subscribed yet, what are you doing? Not forcing you to, but if you do enjoy the video, please leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe, and if you want to go the extra mile, please share with a friend or family and turn on the notification bell. So I just had breakfast at IHOP right behind me. And the food in Boston has been a big miss. This high hop, however, was really, really good. It was actually really worth it. Um, I wish I'd shown you the food, but it came out so quick and we ate it so quickly because we've been hungry the past couple days. Uh, we're about to go check out of our hotel and just have some fun and drive back to New York City. I have a couple friends in the city, so I'm gonna reach out to them and see if they wanna hang out later today or tomorrow before I leave and go back to Buffalo. So, my hand is getting tired. I'll talk to you later. Peace. Oh, you don't know. Yeah, give me your